Hello everybody, this is Evan Irwin from System Improvements for the Taproot System Software. And today we're going to be talking about the basics, the absolute bare minimums of the software. Basically how you're going to get around, uh, how you create reports, how you do corrective actions, how you create snap charts. We're just going to start going uh, one by one down the line and uh, so you can learn the software at your own pace if you like by watching these videos um, and see how it works. So what you're looking at right now is the incident manager screen right after you install the software. That means it has no incidents in there. So we're going to make one and we do that by clicking on the new button right here. So now the incident editor window popped up and in it we'll see the title and incident number and incident date. And of course there's a whole lot of other fields there are no other fields that are required other than title, incident number, and incident date. So if you're running short on time and you just want to get something in there so you can look at it later, um, just put in, you know, my new incident, incident number, you know, you may have an, a numbering system, maybe C123, and the incident date will make it today. So with that said, we can go over here and click Save and we can edit the incident further if we like or we can click save and close and now you see that there's a new incident listed up here so if we edit this incident by by highlighting it which is already which it is highlighted by default and clicking the edit button we can go back in here and fill in such things as locations classifications we can create snap charts we can do echo factor we can do root cause analysis once we do our snap chart and find our causal factors but that will all be covered later. So I hope this was a very quick and easy to understand rundown on how to create new incidents. Next time we'll cover stuff like uh, how to create locations, classifications, and the beginnings of Snapchart. Thanks for watching.